Okay, for these problems, what we want to do is find the y-intercept of each. We find the y-intercept by plugging in 0 for x. So I'm going to replace x with 0, and then we just want to know what this equals, and we're going to say that's the y-intercept. Okay, and it's going to be written in the form 0, some number, whatever y is. Okay, this one, 0 minus 6 is negative 6. Negative 6 squared is 36. 36 plus 8 is 44. So this one has a y-intercept of 0, 44. If I plug in 0 for x on this one, 0 plus 2 is 2. 2 squared is 4. 4 times negative 4 is negative 16. And negative 16 minus 9 is negative 25. So again, 0 for the x value, negative 25 for the y. On this one, plug in 0 for x. 0 minus 5 is negative 5. Negative 5 squared is 25, and that's all that is there. So again, 0 for the x, 25, positive 25 this time for the y. Plug in 0 for x on number 4. Uh, it gives you 0 minus 2 is negative 2. Negative 2 squared is 4. Half of 4 is 2. 2 plus 3 is uh, 5. So we have 0, 5 for the y-intercept on the last one.